Testis cancer is um, like many cancers. We don't know the exact ET the exact cause. Uh, we know a little bit about it, and we know that there are some chromosomal, some genetic changes that develop to get testis cancer. But it doesn't look like we inherit those changes. And there are some issues about whether or not very early in life, even from an embryonal stage, whether one can predispose to the development of testis cancer. Unlike many other cancers where we know there are direct uh, lifestyle um, factors involved, there is no one specific cause for testicular cancer. We know there are a number of risk factors. The most common risk factor is a, a condition called cryptoorchidism, which basically means undescended testicle. And when a male baby is born, your testicles will drop down into the scrotum within a few months after birth. If this doesn't happen, it can be surgically corrected by a simple operation. What we know is that around about 5 to 10 percent of men with testicular cancer have had a past history of this condition. Other risks for testicular cancer appear to be family history. If your father or brother has testicular cancer, you're more likely to develop it. The reason it affects this age group, again, we don't know enough of the, about the details of that, but it's likely that the genetic abnormalities occur, that occur from an embryonal stage, present themselves, take that period of time to present themselves. If they haven't presented themselves by that time, they're unlikely to subsequently occur. Also, some recent research has suggested that men who smoke cannabis on a regular basis, who go on to develop testicular cancer, may actually develop a much more potent and aggressive type of testicular cancer. It seems to be a northern European, particularly Scandinavian population is particularly high. Um, there's also some data to suggest that taller men rather than shorter men may be at increased risk. But you know, it's one of those things that it, it's not a hard and fast rule. Um, the risk, the relative risk of being taller rather than less tall is relatively small. The bottom line is, if you have a mass in your testis, get it checked out, get it dealt with, see your doctor because the outcomes are excellent if we treat patients early.